How's it going, gamers? Welcome back to The Room Syndrome. Um, I noticed some things while editing the last video, and that is how stupid I am. Uh, I could have done multiple things differently. First of all, the batteries I found, I could have put in the other radio. I hope there's an option to take those out. Although, considering I went to the radio before and press examine, I'm finding that not to be the case. So, what I think what I'm saying is I could have done a different route. And I did find out uh, there are different endings. So, I'm going to just screw one ending for me. Also, I wonder if I had put it in the chest and closed it, would the batteries still have appeared? That That's another question I have. Also... The author of the other letters that we, we read, and by the way, read terribly because I, I was trying to do a voice, but I'll try to read better in the future. What if that author is, uh, is the person he's talking about in this letter over here? What if he's like, that That was his, his wife or girlfriend or someone he loved, like I said last episode. Because uh, the author knew who David was. Because he said, I've been to David's timeline. And I'm assuming that means David knows who I'm talking about. So I'm assuming it's David, you're lying to me. Alright, and I'm going to figure out how to fix this radio. See, but here's the thing. The reason I couldn't figure out last time, I have no idea what to do. Because it doesn't... It doesn't get... It doesn't tell you what to do. Maybe if I have a conversation with David again. You hungry? No, I just... I, I need to know... Uh, how long? I, that, radio, 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 radio. You fixed it? Why? Why would you do that? The last time the radio was messed up. Uh, the last time the radio was messed with, it caused a lot of pain and suffering. So you didn't know about the radio, you just didn't decide to tell us. I would really appreciate it if you would please leave it alone. Radio. I said leave it alone. Destroy the cursed device. If you don't, I will. Eventually. I don't think David is normal. I think he got a little mad. I think I remember what it was like. Looking for a way out. It was so long ago. I really wish I could tell you there was, but there isn't. Believe me, you waste your time. I don't know if this is... Okay. I told you not to waste your time. There's no key. There's no way out. There's nothing else out there. You're just going to end up... Never mind. Just stop. Just don't talk to me about it. You see, I... I'm gonna keep talking about it. Stop it! Stop trying to give me hope! You're taunting me! There's nothing! Nothing to try for! This is it! Don't you realize? This is the end! We're all stuck here, waiting for time to realize there's nothing left! We are... We are waiting to die! David is not normal. It's over the television. You can't take a hint, can you? In this conversation now, you are rude and in insensitive person. I'm done talking about this. Fine, David. Be annoyed. I don't care. I'm going to get out of here. Just because you don't have any hope. Okay, so what I figured out last time that I didn't show you guys is if you turn it all the way down through here, and you take the knob and turn it all the way down here. That happens. And I can do that. Alright. But, if you do the opposite and turn it this way. Because there's just pure stack right here. And you can still do this. Whoa, whoa. Oh, I figured it out. Okay, so there were red bleeps and stuff on the side right there. I thought you had to set them all to green for some dumb reason. No. If you set it right, 
like if you set it to the right one and then flip the switch it sends you to another one that's amazing so my theory is the guy uh the guy or girl because you know of the whole oh, i miss her thing is this girl actually figured a way to get out she what she did is what i'm getting from this is each room is a separate timeline so what she did is it found a bunch of ways to overlap the timelines until a point where she found her way out. Don't know how she found her way out, but I guess we'll find out. Piece of paper. What do you want to do? Read it. The time travel frequency seems to be have to do. The time travel frequency seems to have something to do with even odd, an odd number. This is the whole. This is the same room. What the f fun. This piece of paper. What do you do? Read it. Nothing seems to connect anymore. I cannot take anything with me. But for some reason, the drawer and the end of the table seems to keep anything I put in it, regardless of the timeline. I can use this. Maybe I could find the key to the door and bring me, uh, bring it here. There is a key. There is a key. Then. There it is. There's the key. Right? No, that's a spoon. Great, great, great job. So there's a key. I'm not touching a touching a box. I learned my lesson. Look at all these papers. How long? I, I'm just curious. How long have they been here? Because think about how much, like, how many papers. Like, where did you get all this paper? First of all, there's no paper in here. Oh, that's epic. Okay. So what happens if I touch this? I just hope I'm back to this timeline. Cause these are timelines. So I'm assuming. Okay, we're at this frequency right now. That's a. I don't know what that is. So. Oh. Okay. This is our. This is home frequency right here. So there was one really close to us. If you go all the way to this side, there's one over here. Okay, so it's at the end. Whoa. What? Hello? Is anyone here? I can go off screen. I just appear on the other side. So, this is break game. So wait, it's the same for the other side. So if I go on the other side, does that mean there's a room but I can get out of it? I don't know. We'll just see. Well, I just have to see, you know. So there. Oh, it's bookmarked. Okay. Oh wow. Um. I didn't notice the current. Doesn't seem the current's having too fun of a time over there. Okay. All right. Whoa, 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 back up, back up. Here we go. Oh, there's a note by him. Ah, but I don't know if it gets rid of by... We're gonna read this one first, then. This can't be happening. Who is this creep? Why is he all alone here? There has to be some way out of here. I don't trust it. You talking about... You talking about David? You talking about David? I don't know, David, other than being kind of dodgy when you ask him questions, doesn't seem that bad of a guy to me. Okay, I'm just going to prepare. What's hap- What is happening? What is happening? Is that the train? Wait, I don't want to read this paper, though. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, stop it. Stop. Stop. I can't say. Help me. Help me. I know that last one was help me. Oh, I created a paradox by staying too long. I just wrecked the whole. 
Oh no, I understand what he meant by not touch the radio now. Okay, so you guys don't know what just happened. I just basically screwed up. I stayed for too long. Someone else appeared in another in, in a new room, and I was not supposed to be there. So I just destroyed it by uh, making a paradox. So that timeline's completely wrecked now. I I'll have to hurry up next time. Um, oh. Oh wow. Uh, no, that's not the blue guy. Yeah. What do you do? Read it. Read it. I thought I did it, but I'm just back in the room again. He's not here though, so I guess I it was a success. I may regret this though. The thought of being alone is frightful, and look what happened to the room. Did David do this? Was it because I left? I can't help but feel slightly guilty. At least I can figure uh, this radio out in peace. There's some pattern to this thing, some way to control where this device takes me. It's got to be in the right combination of dials. Maybe if I just... I don't really know what happened to him. Maybe I should stop messing with the radio. Nah, nah, let's keep messing with the radio. <laughs> There's a note by him. I need to hurry though. I need to hurry though. No! It's a piece of paper. Would you like? No, they have. Examine. Read it. He thinks he owns me. This, absur this is absurd. We are already sleeping in the same bed. What more does he want? Okay, so this is a woman or either this is a man still. Cannot be sure. Not nowadays. So what? I'm messing with radio. radio. I'm close to figuring it out. This isn't just a radio. It's something more. If only I could spend more uh, than just nights figuring it out. I know it'll take me uh, uh, away from this place. I need to get out uh, of here before he reacts worse than last night. We keep fighting over stupid things. It's getting harder to feel bad for him. David, David doesn't seem like he's being all that kind of nice. Nothing. Do nothing. We learn from experience not to crush boxes. I'm leaving though now, so. Aha! There's one last one. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I get to read it! Run, 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 run. Read it. Read it. Read it. It's a piece of paper. What do you do? Read it. This doesn't work. It does. No! 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 I, I, I'm so. St I just tried to read it right. I kept messing up the voice. No, I'm sorry. I gotta leave. Oh. No. No, I refuse. I refuse. Nope. Nope. Load. I refuse. See that? I just went all the way back. I'll be right back. I'm not gonna create a parallel universe this time. This doesn't work. It just doesn't make any sense. How am I supposed to explain the phenomenon here? There is no way out of this room. Nothing inside follows any kind of logic. The door is locked shut with no sign of a key. Is this a prison? Am I part of an ex some experiment? Whoever left this room for me to set up several curious anemones for somehow f that somehow function the windows reveal a void of nothingness yet television set and stove still function as though uh, they have like electricity and for some reason the television gets one channel it's just static though wait i think i see a number hidden behind the static no it's the number two now run run to the radio run to the radio and tune the radio piece of paper what do you want to do read it she lied to me i woke up and she was not in bed she was fiddling with that stupid radio she told me it was because they were uh, she was bored why did she think she can escape i've already tried to many times i think it, i i still understand but my memory out uh, of the outside world is getting so dim 
which makes me hard to sim which makes it hard to sympathize. I really need to convince her that it is pointless. I wasted so much of my time trying to leave. There is nothing left out in there anyway. Maybe if you didn't waste so much time after the fact, if you said you tried. Maybe if he had not like been so. Oh, there's no escape because he tried forever to escape. And maybe if he was more like this person who, I don't know, apparently was his his lover. Like, maybe if you were more like them, then you would have found a way to escape. Because we can't find her. Either she died or she escaped. So. I've cracked it. The radio allows me to travel through time. I'm not sure, but there's something to do with the frequency and volume. There's not seem to be describable order. It certainly isn't linear because I have numbers on both sides uh, take me pat to the past and to the future. I figure out the pattern eventually, but now at least I'm somewhere. Okay, well, that's all good and stuff, but I need to, like, go now because I wasted too much time. Alright, I'm back. I have went through all of the timelines again. When they did collapse, there was a train outside. And I arrived on the train. And who was the person who said this is the final stop? Because that was a person. And why did I walk in the house? There's so many questions. Anyways, I don't think, uh, I hope he didn't notice that we were gone. Because I think he's going to be a little mad that we left. It's fine. He'll forgive us. It's David. It's David. <laughs> Hi, David. You hungry? See, hmm. He's normal, but I probably shouldn't push this. None of your business. How did you even know about this? So you did lie to me. I have no reason to talk to you about this. Th to this about you. It was a private matter between me and her, and it was really none of your business. Okay, so we know it was a her now. <laughs> that is important. That was so important. Nice job, Gabriel. I'm just gonna keep pushing this. Why? I asked you to leave the subject alone. So it means nothing to me anymore. She means nothing to me anymore. And she left a long time ago. She exactly! She left! How? I mean, I know it was by the radio, but you were there. If she left, so can you. She's not even around, so it's not even relevant to you. I don't even want to talk to her about, about her. I don't even want to, I want to remember. It's good to remember. David, come on. I told you to leave the subject alone. I hate her. I don't even want to have her in my mind. Stop asking. That's red. David. David. Okay. So I probably shouldn't do this. But. She hated me. What I did to her. I. I was nice. I was polite. She just wouldn't stop. She wanted to leave me alone. Abandon me. No, she didn't. She wanted to find a way out of here. We became so close. One fight, and she left. Why? Because they're being kind of a word that YouTube won't let me say. Because she's selfish. She only cares about herself. No. I tried so hard, but she's obsessed over that damn radio. No. She, wa she wanted to find a way out. Dog, calm down. She wanted to find a way out. She wanted both of you to find a way out. You were the one who didn't let her. There's nothing about there. Home isn't real. Only this hellhole of room exists. The version of the room exists. She probably wasn't even real. Such a cruel woman couldn't possibly exist. You're seeing like you're the cruel one, man. Get out of my face, you nosy piece of... Oh, yeah, you're so polite. I'm sorry. I can't do this anymore. Leave. Leave me alone. He's so normal. David is so normal. 
Okay, I have a theory. Maybe if I go to all the parallel, you know, timelines and tune the TVs. Because I'm assuming if I crush all the boxes, that also does something. But I really don't want to crush the boxes. I did it, 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 so good. Oh, what the f- There's a pile of keys on the ground. Put the mess, what do you do? Take a key. Can I put it? I put it in the drawer. Open the drawer. I'm gonna figure a way out. Put it inside key. Oh! Okay. Alright, alright. I gotta, gotta leave. That was amazing. But I'm still gonna connect all the channels. It had a TV in it. Alright, so that line uh, right over there next to the bin, that leads to it. I go here, here. Okay, TV on. Wait, there's a note here too. It's a piece of paper. What do you want to do? Read it. Batteries. Hide the batteries. That's the way. That way he can't follow me. They're in one uh one hundred five point three. Two keys. I've taken every key from every possible time uh time frame and brought them here. Now the monster should never be allowed to escape. Damn creep. He could stay and deal with the paradoxes for all I care. Number three, lock. I've locked the chest at the original time frame. There's no key in there, but if there's uh, any chance he finds a way, I don't want him restoring, uh, restoring the paradoxes. And in case I forget, the combination etched under the table in uh, is etched under the table in 79.3. I need to make sure to enter the second number uh, last or else it won't work for some reason. So, okay. Then I'll burn this letter after I take it. Alright, I gotta mumble off here because I, I gotta turn on this TV for a paradox happens. No, 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 hurry. Okay, change it to five. Go, 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 go. Alright. Alright, guys. So, I'm going to have to end it here. Uh, I stopped in a paradox. So, nothing would happen. Uh, but, I'll see. But, we'll figure out the everything in the next channel. We got a key now. Everything's good. But, I'll see you gamers in the next one.